Now then, uh, Wrexham Steel promotion to League One uh, with a battering of Forest Green Rovers at the weekend. So Phil Parkinson's side booking a return to English football's third tier for the first time since 2004 to 2005. Successive promotions as well. Joining us now to tell us if there's going to be a special Hollywood party is Wrexham captain Ben Tozer. Morning, Ben. Morning, how are we? You all right? Probably better than you, mate. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> no, Sophie, no chance, no. Sophie, your wife has been on and she texted us. She said, I'll make sure that Ben's awake for 9.15, but not sure how much conversation you'll get out of him. So <laughs> it was quite a night, was it? Oh, to be fair, you know, it's brilliant. We, we enjoyed the moment with the fans and yesterday it was it was all about where we were. It was the fat boar in, in Wrexham and, and we've we've enjoyed it with, with, with them until the, the early hours, should I say. So... You know, it's it's great to to be able to enjoy them moments with them. Gotcha, Ben. Look, the world wants to know not about how you're going to cope in uh, in League One next season. The world wants to know where you lot are going with the owners. I'm sure they've got some exotic, far far off destination ready for all of you. Have you got your bag packed? I mean, all we've said to them is try and top last year. <laughs> you, can, you know, that, that, that's it, that's it. Well, I, so, I, Ben, Ben, yeah. I've got to let you in on a secret here because Rob McElhenney gave me a call a, a bit earlier on. He says, weekend in real. Yeah. How does that sound? <laughs> Where's that? No, I'm, I'm <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. But look, I mean, Lee, look, Lee won. Um, it, it, it shouldn't hold any surprises for most of you because a lot of you boys have played at that sort of level in the past. We've got an unbelievable squad, you know. We've got great staff as well. That the club's kind of set up for for this, so you know there'd be there'd be no surprises. Um, it would just be a matter of how the fans, how every, everyone kind of how the expectations are going to have to, you know, settle down a little bit because it's we're we're in a, we're in a harder league. Where you've got to respect the clubs that are in it, and uh, you know it's, it's that's the way it's got to go, really. Mm. You. Ben, um, look, the owners have been have, have been incredibly supported ever, ever since they've arrived at the club, and and they've raised the profile. They've obviously spent a lot of money. They've given, they've they've paid the players very good money now. Can this continue? Do you see them being as ambitious from this point onwards? Now, where when you start to step up, it can become a very different game financially, can't it, for the club? Yeah, I think that the. the- the big question is the, the the infrastructure behind the club in terms of the training ground. That's that's the one big thing that 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 needs to be you know addressed, set set in stone. Like you know, so right. it's, it's it's hard because also that doesn't financially give you what you get what you put into it. Do you know what I mean? So it's going to cost a lot of money to to put that in place. Um, but you know, the, the, those guys are, are geniuses. So. They're, they'll they'll figure a way out. They'll find a way of, of, of doing it and making it work. I'm, I'm sure of that. You know, every single Wrexham fan is going to be asking the question. And look, it's not fair, I know, Ben, because you just finished celebrating is, but can you make it three promotions in a row? I mean, I don't, I don't see why the club can, but at the same time... Let's just enjoy this while while it's here, and 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 take the next one as it comes. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Look, Ben, congratulations. Get back to bed, Ben. Thanks. Enjoy real. <laughs> um, yeah, many congratulations to Rex. And just um, to save me getting a million texts, I'm just going to say at the same time, Rexham, brilliant. Congratulations, they are promoted. Stockport. 2019, they're in the National League North. Mark Stott is their owner. He's backed them brilliantly. They'll start next season in League One under the magnificent Dave Challoner. And yes, I am biased. He's a it's a top bloke and a top manager. They will be champions if they win at Notts County tomorrow. And Mansfield and Nigel Clough, effectively, they need one point against Accrington tomorrow to seal promotion. Three would mean it would be absolutely official. And they've been knocking under the door on the door of promotion um, season after season under Nigel Clough. And this season, it looks like they are finally going to make it. So well done to all three of those sides. On AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app, and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.